Yeah, yeah, for good year. Uh, obviously, we won the, the cup, cup final the, the year before, and uh, um, we were the first British team back after the the high school disaster. So uh, we're really flying the flag for mm -hmm. British football at that time, and uh, we're quite aware of that. So to actually go right through after after being away from European football for five years and actually win it. The Cup Winners' Cup of 1991 belongs to Manchester United. The fact that we were able to win the league the first time, I think that was an important point in, in United's history, that we were able to lay that ghost of 20, 25, 26 years, um, and, we, and we were able to shift that. And it took a, a certain type of player and a certain type of individual to be part of a team at that stage, with all that was going on and then all the baggage that we, we had to cope with. And uh, um, I think we were the right side and the right type of people for, for the right time in, in the club's history and uh, the, the club's obviously gone on from that. Yeah, well, everybody mentions the own goal. I think it was, um, I think one of those, it was one of those occasions where uh, our stages in the season, I think there's always one point in, this, in the season where perhaps it, it can go one way or the other and, and I think we were at that point in that game because um, we were going for the treble at the time and I think we just missed out on the first part of it. Uh, we weren't playing particularly well in the league at that time. We were having a little bit of a wobble, um, and we were seconds from going out of the FA Cup. So we could, the season could have just crashed uh, in in that game. But I was able to knock it in, and uh, we just seemed to go on for strength for strength. It was, a little, it was similar to uh, um, Brucey's situation when um, we played Sheffield Wednesday, and we were behind, and then Brucey pops up gets his goals and uh, away we go again. So I think there's always that one point in, in the season. Every Manchester United player by Michael has gone charging upfield. It's Butt. It's only a minute to go. It's come to Lee Sharp. Milligan has to get the head on this. Beckford is needed. He wasn't there. It's hooked back in for Hills. It's there! Why did I leave? Uh, well, I had to get a game somewhere, and it looked like I wasn't going to get a game. So, uh, like I said, I was only, I was only 30, just 31, and uh, I felt I had a few more, more years left of me, and I, I wanted to keep on playing. And uh, I, I could, I could have stayed and uh, just sat on the sidelines, but I thought I had more to offer than that. Um, so it came, it came at a time when. Uh, uh, the club had already bought Andy Cole uh, to replace me, so um, uh, the situation changed a little bit when Eric uh, had his little uh, incident at the Palace, so, so that changed a little bit um, the situation, so I thought well maybe there is an opportunity for me to stay here, uh, but in the, in the summer uh, Eric decided that he was going to try and come back and play, um, which at the time I didn't think he would do, um, so that Really made my mind up. Uh, I knew then I had to, I had to leave. So, uh, so I did. Uh, I found it quite difficult to begin with. Um, I remember the first time I went back with Chelsea. Uh, uh, I think we actually scored first. It was a one-one draw, and we scored first. And uh, all the Chelsea lads gave me stick because um, they reckoned I didn't jump up in the air enough. Uh, but it was quite strange because it was at the Stratford end and um, I think it was Michael Doobie or Wisey or one of them scored and it was just like it was the opposition who scored in the Stratford end and uh, for, for a split second I just didn't react you know it was, but um, that was why I always remember that actually but uh, I had to make sure it didn't happen again. Yeah they, they always give me a, a wonderful welcome when I, when I go back there. Um, I think they, they appreciate what, what I was about and what I tried to do for the club. Um, obviously, you know, we were marvellous for me and my career, but uh, I'd like to think I give the fans a, a few memories to remember me by.